Nicholas uses I to handle scammers. Recently, scams to steal Pi coins have been diverse in both content and form. In the web free space and the freedom of crypto, these scams have become increasingly varied, making it difficult for pioneers to recognize them, and the biggest risk is losing the pie they've mined. The most dangerous and financially damaging scam at the moment involves combining multiple existing features of Pi Network, including fake websites and sending Pi to victims to lure them into fake sites. Utilizing many features to scam has left many pioneers empty-handed. However, recently, the Pi Core team has begun to act, adding a feature to scan transactions with signs of fraud and display warnings to users. We hope this feature will soon address the current scams on the Pi Network. Protecting your Pi wallet and assets is always the top priority when participating in Pi mining. Therefore, we are sure this upcoming video will be very useful for pioneers to protect their assets. Please continue to follow along. Part 1. Be cautious when you suddenly receive Pi. One day, when you open your Pi wallet, you suddenly see a few Pi transfers from unknown senders. The amount of Pi is usually small, like 0.0314 or 0.314. Along with it is a message congratulating you on your account being mainlit, asking you to follow the link to check your account. The link resembles the Pi browser interface up to 99%, even the layout looks exactly like the official Pi wallet interface. Specifically, they send Pi to your wallet, and when you click on the details, the memo content includes messages like congratulations on winning a prize, you have just received Pi on the mainnet. When you encounter this, it is certain that you are a target of scammers. Just following the instructions will immediately result in losing your Pi. This trick has been warned about many times in our previous videos. Fortunately, the Pi Core team now has a solution to alert the community about such transactions. Part 2. Pi Core Team Takes Action To ensure the correct use of project domain names, pioneers should thoroughly research before accessing any links. Go directly to the project's site and obtain the link. Avoid using floating links on the internet, or those sent by strangers. Especially with the Pi Wallet update feature, pioneers should only click the wallet icon on the Pi browser and not manually enter domain names. These are the simplest and most proactive steps to eliminate the risk of scams. However, if this could counter new tricks, there wouldn't have been recent hacking incidents. Therefore, the Pi Core team has introduced a very simple and effective anti-scam method. This is adding AI technology to scan suspicious transactions from hackers. If a Pi transfer with a note similar to a scam is detected, with a link inside, the transaction will display in the note section as filtered as spam. This recognition reduces the chance of being hacked by 99%, because when you see this notice, you will certainly not follow the misleading instructions. However, why 99%? Because this is still automated technology, not all fraudulent transactions may be thoroughly scanned. Thus, pioneers should remain cautious with unfamiliar transactions. Part 3. Pi Network's Constant Instability In addition to adding anti-scam features, the Pi Core team has been very busy with network updates lately. Specifically, after the Telltale K wallet lock event, numerous instability signs have continuously occurred, such as, numerous letters from the community and Teltalk sent to the Pi Core team requesting the unlocking of the Teltalk wallet. This enormous pressure forces the Pi Core team to handle it promptly to avoid losing the community. Node machines being unstable, losing connection, losing bonuses continuously without clear reasons. And most recently, the Pi wallet could not access accounts. After the Tell Talk event, it seems the network has experienced many issues, and the Pi Core team will need considerable time to resolve them. However, this instability might also be a sign that Pi is preparing for the open mainnet. We will continue to follow the latest developments of the Pi network and update the community soon. CryptoLeak VN is delighted to accompany and explore Pi Network with the pioneers over the past time. Thank you, community, for trusting and supporting the channel. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel to receive the latest notifications about the Pi Network. If you are looking for a continuously updated information channel about Pi Network, you can also join the CryptoLeak VN Community Facebook group. We share a lot of quick news about Pi Network and trading signals on these social networks. The participation link will be right below the video description. Thank you to all the pioneers for following along. Goodbye and see you in the next videos.